Hey, it's Deej. Did you get out and vote? You better have. And no, Richie Poole, I did not vote for a Democrat. No. And no, you can't send AOC after me because that's Bird's woman, not mine. Just don't even go there. Don't even try to say that. Hell no. Anyway, here I am out in the field, like normal. Still looking at all these windmills. All these damn windmills. You know, the damn windmills that they shut down whenever there's too much power. The windmills that are subsidized by the government all the time because they're too damn expensive and they can't pay for themselves. Yeah, those things. Those crap ass things, folks. Anyway, I digress. Hopefully everybody did get out and vote today. Hopefully you're having a good day. It's turned out to be a fairly decent day out here. It's uh, 10 o'clock in the morning already. We've been at this for a little while. Um, let's see. It's almost 50 degrees already. It's supposed to be in the 60s today. Unusual for uh, November 4th or November 3rd. And remember, it is 10 a.m., so hopefully... Uh, you know, 10 a.m. first Tuesday of the month, usually cities do their storm siren tests. Hopefully none of you accidentally thought it was the start of the purge. I'd hate to see you get in a little trouble. So no, 10 o'clock, you did not have the start of the purge, folks. No purge. You cannot run around and have 12 hours of, well, you know. So it was not the start of the purge, folks. It, it Just because it's election day and you heard that go off at 10 o'clock, that does not mean it's the start of the purge. No. Oh, rabbit. Where'd he go? He's running away. Yes, now I'm chasing rabbits out in the field, people. First it's skunks, then coyotes, now it's rabbits. Ah. <sighs> Wildlife. Eh, we should be done with this field in a few hours as long as there's no uh, breakdowns. Not sure what he has planned next after this. Which field? Don't know. I know I, I need to go uh, stop back at the farm on the way back to the next field and get some more diesel in this thing because... Where is it? There it is, I'm at half. My diesel said half. Yes, I'm, I, I'm at half, folks. I, I need more fuel. Anyway. So, uh, hopefully some of you are watching this because if things go the way I think they're going to go, whenever I get home and upload this and all that and the election's still going on, oh, there goes the rabbit again. Run, rabbit, run! Anyway, I may live stream. You may actually see me live streaming while this, after this gets uploaded. It usually kills my analytics on it. Really kills that shit, because who wants to watch a video when I'm live? I shouldn't be, I shouldn't stream, because, you know, I should go to bed. I should be in bed sleeping, because I'll have to work tomorrow, but, you know, I, Curiosity is going to kill the Deej. And I will have to check out some of the uh, news channels. See how uh, they're handling things. Yep. The way organizations in Central Illinois is goodwill. And it has to do with the... There goes another dang coyote. They're just a-watching us. This one sure ain't afraid of much, because it's after the dang, uh... This one seems to be chasing rabbits. There it goes. Ah, 
that got away. That one blended in with the corn pretty well too, but... Damn. There she is again. Yep, coming up. This one ain't afraid much either, folks. This one just sits there and watches us. Now you're going to run right back into the corn, which you're slowly running out of spots there. Get the camera going this time because, you know, as soon as we start up that other way, I'm not sure which side she's going to pop out. I got a feeling she's trying to use us too to hunt rabbit. while we're at this so we'll find out in a minute because I know she's in that corn right now what I don't know is if she's going to shoot back out on the opposite side there where I can't see Or if she's going to get chased and flushed out on this end. Oh, there she is. Yeah. I can't get any closer with the camera, but there she goes. A little coyote's just a run and just sitting there staring at us. Yep. All right, that's enough of that one for now. We are people. Well, let's see here. We're coming up on her again and into the corn she went. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Keeps getting away from me. But we're almost done with this field, folks, and it'll be down to four. Wonder if I go real slow here and stay with the combine. If she'll be flushed out at the end of the row. She knows she's running out of room. We only got a couple of more passes left of this field. Then there's four left. Only four left, folks. And those four should be done within three days. Take three days' time to do them. If there's no issues, no problems, no malfunctions, none of that sort of thing, you know. But yeah. There you are, folks. This is how it's going. This is how it's going. Oh well, we'll figure it out. And we'll see if I'm back again. Yep, still hiding in the corn. Oh, there she was. She come out right at the end and ran back in. I think. Oh. She's running right along the edge, sitting there looking at us. Getting a little pissed off of batting. Keeps running out of room. She's a brave one though. She does stay close. Anyway, Steej. Alright folks, I'm out here. She is right there, looking at me, looking at her. That's where that coyote is. She's right there, folks. Of course, I'm shaking like hell because ooh, quantum. But yeah, she's right there. And there she goes. She peeked right back in. Yeah, she's right there, though. 
And here I am standing out with her. Windier and hell out here today. Again. But yeah, I just wanted to show you that little coyote sitting there still. All right, folks, I'm gonna hush up again. Truck ought to be here in a couple of minutes so I can unload and get the last of this done. About one load left here. This is the Deej one. I'm gonna say goodbye to all these wind farm windmills. Because where we go next, there are none of them anywhere near. There was two of them in there. Three of them in there. Three coyotes in there. Now I understand why she wasn't leaving. Because the other two were probably her pups. A little big for pups, but... Yep. That is why she was so intent on staying around that area. Three coyotes came out of there, folks. Wow. And here I stand along the road. We're down to four fields. This one, of course, is about 170 acres worth. So I'm guessing maybe two days worth of picking out here. The others are about 40 acres combined. Easily a one day pick session. So we may be done by Friday, folks. As long as there's no, uh, no other mishaps. Of course, uh, just never know. But I thought I'd give that update. Yep, I'm just waiting on the combine. I got over here faster than he could. So now I have to wait on that. Maybe you probably hear it's windy out here too. Hope you got out and voted. This is Deej. Well, folks, the sun is setting. We're still out here. Just was chasing a possum. Maybe we'll get some possum-flavored flakes for bird of prey. Possum-flavored flakes. Yeah, I tried to say that three times real fast. Possum-flavored flakes. Possum-flavored flakes. Possum-flavored flakes. Yeah. But, yep, sunset. Did you vote? Are you annoyed yet that I keep asking? Even though it's just like blip, blip, blip. It's hours for me between times when I've asked you, but for you it's just poof, poof, poof. And uh, stay tuned to the end of this video because I may have a couple of individual pictures stuck to the end of it, of that coyote. You never know. This is the Deej. I'm out of here for the night, guys. I'll see you on the live stream.